this bronze medalist has the edge. We'll have to wait and see the outcome. really fast isn't it yeah very nice beginning of the kata which is the most important thing to attract the referees with the, your performance speed the power and of course the technique Ariel is always one of the best athletes to know how uh, he chose the katas and uh, uh, he knows always how to choose the best katas with all his opponents You're talking here about um, the strategic plan exactly. of who you're up against and which kata you need to use. Yeah, of course. Uh, sometimes, for example, especially if you are doing uh, against a different style, uh, you always need to have a strategy with your katas. So, uh, for example, uh, Elliot is a very good friend of mine, so he always speaks to me and say like, uh, uh, I use, like with the Shotokan, I use this strategy, and with the Shitori Okata, I always use a different strategy, so we always have a plan, and that's the right thing that we all always do. Very nice performance from Elliot, as usual. Very confident performance, wasn't it? Exactly. It's very important all, always in Qatar to show your confidence when you are inside the mat, uh, because I believe that the referees, they always uh, feel it. And uh, my father, he's also a WKF referee, and he's always telling me that, that we always feel uh, when we are uh, like judges and watching the katas, we feel that uh, if the athlete's inside, he's confident of himself and his performance. Uh, it's so clear for us, and of course, it, uh, uh, like uh, for us, it's so important to see the athlete is not not nervous because it affects on his performance for sure. That's exactly right, and and, and athletes can give an aura, on, and a presence, and that can make such a difference. That can Ikira. Uishi of Japan make a difference here in his performance of Anan. Anan, Anan and Anandai, uh, almost similar katas but with different techniques. Uh, they are both uh, strong cutters in uh, this style, so I think now we will see from the Japanese like uh, focusing more on the techniques more than anything. So let's enjoy this cutter. Akira, just 23 years of age, he's looking a little like he's trying to emulate the legend of Kyo. Indeed, indeed. Four-time world champion, Olympic champion, unbelievable. Yeah, he's like the legend of Kata. 
Mail Kata. He's, uh, it was always a pleasure to uh, do the competitions with him because even he's in Asia, so we are always with him in the Asian World Premier League competitions. So he's a real legend. Very good transition, moving from one to another. Yeah, he's like uh, not having any risks. He's doing uh, his uh, all power with all, uh, even like to change from Dutch to Dutchy. It's not easy with this kata, so he's doing his uh, full power, which he's showing like he's so stable in the tatami. So as. Akida Ruishi of Japan concludes the kata. The judges will be making their decision and then we will have the announcement of the results. And there is, on the bottom of the screen, you'll see a graphic with the technical performance and athletic performance and the scores against each. The athlete with the highest score wins the bag. you have an opinion, Mohammed? Uh, well, it's so difficult, but uh, I think it will be close. <laughs> Diplomatic of you, 7-9-2 at the moment. Ariel yeah, Torres yeah. Gutierrez in the lead, 18-2. It is indeed a successful day for Ariel Torres Gutierrez of the United States.